hello friends welcome to my channel it's been uh, quite some time i have not published any uh, new contents on my channel due to my new project setup it's now at its uh, final stage and soon i'm going to start the operations this is a 10 lakh liter water capacity project and i'm using this time pond liner instead of biplog tank this will be a new experience for me uh, using the pond liner and uh, soon i'll be sharing more uh, about this project okay and if you are new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe it and if you do that whenever i'm going to publish new uh, content on my uh, channel you will be get notified and you can easily access the content okay you can see it here still the water loading is going on and it will take uh, another couple of days uh, to uh, complete it and once it is completed then i'll do the water preparation and the other stuff okay and uh, soon i'm going to share all this information uh, on my channel now let me share about the venami stream culture that i have been uh, doing in this winter season it's been 128 days of the culture but i don't see uh, much uh, growth difference between 90 days and 120 days due to the low temperature Still, it's going to mid of the February, but uh, the temperature remains under 24 degree. Due to the low temperature, the feed intake is very less, which actually impacts the shrimp growth. If you are uh, part of my channel, uh, you must be knowing that I have three different stocking density in three different 10,000 liter tanks. In first tank, I have stocked 10,000 pieces. In second tank, 6,000 pieces. In third tank, 4,500 pieces. Most probably end of this week, I am going to harvest all of these three tanks and I will share my experience. Again, I will repeat this same project uh, in summer to compare the data between the winter season and the summer season. This is the tank number one where I had uh, stocked 10,000 uh, pieces of the Venami shrimp and it's been uh, more than 120 days uh, now and uh, you can see uh, the growth difference uh, between uh, the 90 days and 120 days okay so i don't see much growth difference between uh, this 30 days gap so you can see it uh, we have put around uh, 10 pieces here and you can see uh, from this scale uh, the average growth is uh, between 6 to 8 okay so last time also in 90 days period also the growth was uh, uh, in between 6 to 8 gram okay and it's in it's been 128 days still the growth is same okay there is no main uh, no major uh, development on the growth side so this is the second uh, tank where we have stock uh, 6000 pieces and uh, last time the growth was uh, roughly 8 to 10 grams and uh, there is a slight uh, increment here in the second tank okay so this time uh, after uh, 128 days the growth is nearly about average growth is uh, about uh, 10 to uh, 14 gram in between that okay so average will be around roughly it will be around 14 grams on the second tank where i had uh, stock 6000 uh, pieces okay so you can see it here it shows in the scale shows are around uh, 13.89 so roughly you can see this is a, a 13 to 14 gram is the average weight on the second tank uh, now let's uh, go to the third tank where we kept uh, 4500 uh, pieces okay so we can uh, measure the weight okay and we'll see the difference last time uh, the weight was roughly the average was uh, 9 to 11 grams and you can see it here so what is the weight uh, as of today so it's been 128 days and uh, you can see it here from the scale it's showing around the same uh, 10 to 11 grams so there is no uh, much difference here okay see it's uh, showing around roughly around 11 grams this was about uh, the Venami shrimp growth update after 120 days of the culture. Normally, it's uh, not good idea to start the culture in winter season unless you have some mechanism in place to control the water temperature. I am going to repeat the same project in summer season to compare the data between two seasons that is summer and winter. 
if you have any uh, queries uh, please post it on the comment section and i'll try to respond to you as earliest as possible end of this week i'm going to uh, publish the harvesting video along with uh, all of my cultural experience which definitely going to help you if you want to seriously do the shrimp culture using the biflog system please don't forget to subscribe my channel and uh, if you really like my contents please share it among your friends and family members thank you so much for your encouragement and love thank you so much